There is an age-old debate that often stirs up intense feelings on both sides, Jamaicans versus black Americans. Some claim that despite shared African ancestry and the brutal history of the transatlantic slave trade, the two cultures are worlds apart. Others argue that we were just dropped off by the same ship in different locations. This analogy, while simple, highlights a profound truth. Despite the differences in accents, food and cultural expressions, the connections between Jamaicans and black Americans run deep, particularly when we consider the contributions of Jamaicans to black American culture. But how exactly did these contributions shape American society? To find out, stick around, because the last point we're going to discuss will truly surprise you. Before we dive into the story, if you're enjoying this video so far, make sure to hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications to join our community. Now, let's explore the incredible impact Jamaicans have had on black American culture, starting with a bit of historical context. Both Jamaica and the United States have histories scarred by the brutalities of slavery and colonialism. In Jamaica, the British Empire established a ruthless plantation economy that thrived on the backs of African slaves. Meanwhile, in the United States, enslaved Africans were forced to build the economic foundations of the southern states. The horrors endured were unimaginable, yet from these atrocities arose cultures rich in resilience and creativity. It's said that a significant portion of the enslaved Africans brought to the Caribbean and the United States originated from the same regions in Africa. These individuals shared a common heritage, language and traditions. However, over time, the experiences in these two different lands shaped their cultures in unique ways. Despite these differences, the cultural exchange between Jamaicans and black Americans has been a two-way street, especially after the wave of voluntary black immigration in the 20th century. As of 2019, there were approximately 4.6 million black immigrants living in the United States, and nearly half of them were from the Caribbean, with Jamaicans making up a substantial portion of this group. In fact, Jamaicans alone accounted for 16% of the black immigrant population in the US. This massive diaspora has played a crucial role in enriching the fabric of black American culture, from the arts to politics and even to the highest offices of government. So how did Jamaicans leave such a mark on black American culture? Let's start with one of the most significant contributions, music and dance. It may surprise you to know that there's a compelling theory suggesting Jamaicans played a foundational role in the birth of hip-hop, a genre that has become synonymous with black American culture. In the early 1970s, DJ Cool Herc, a Jamaican immigrant, introduced the concept of toasting to the Bronx, New York. Toasting is a style of rhythmic speech over a beat, a precursor to what we now know as rapping. Herc's unique style of mixing breakbeats on turntables became the blueprint for hip-hop. And the rest, as they say, is history. But hip-hop is just the tip of the iceberg. Jamaican music, with its vibrant beats and compelling rhythms, has influenced many mainstream American musicians. Reggae, dancehall and ska have all found their way into the American musical landscape, infusing it with fresh sounds and styles. Artists like Sean Paul and Shaggy, who enjoyed massive success in the US, have shown how Jamaican music can dominate the global charts. Then there are icons like Biggie Smalls and Grace Jones. Biggie, born Christopher Wallace, was the son of Jamaican immigrants. His lyrical genius and storytelling prowess made him a legend in hip-hop, while his Jamaican roots subtly influenced his music and persona. Grace Jones, with her larger-than-life persona, avant-garde style and powerful presence, challenged norms in both music and fashion. Born in Jamaica and raised in the US, she became a symbol of breaking boundaries and redefining what it meant to be a black artist in America. The influence of Jamaican dance cannot be ignored either. Dancehall styles like Brook Out and Daggering have been incorporated into global pop culture. Even mainstream American artists like Rihanna and Beyonce have drawn inspiration from Jamaican dance and incorporated these elements into their performances. Next, we delve into the contributions of one of Jamaica's most influential sons, Marcus Garvey. Born in St. Anne's Bay, Jamaica in 1887, 
Garvey was a visionary who laid the groundwork for future black empowerment movements. He migrated to the United States in 1916 and founded the Universal Negro Improvement Association, advocating for the global unification and empowerment of African people. Garvey's philosophy was revolutionary. He preached self-reliance, economic independence and pride in African heritage at a time when racial segregation and disenfranchisement were rampant in the US. His message resonated deeply with African Americans who were grappling with the harsh realities of life under Jim Crow laws. Garvey's influence was so profound that he inspired future civil rights leaders like Martin Luther King Jr. and Malcolm X. In fact, Malcolm X's parents were avid supporters of Garvey's movement. The legacy of Marcus Garvey lives on in modern black American culture. His teachings on black pride and self-sufficiency continue to inspire movements advocating for economic empowerment and social justice. The phrase black is beautiful can be traced back to Garvey's influence, a testament to his enduring impact on how black Americans perceive their identity. Bob Marley's influence on black American culture. No discussion of Jamaican contributions to American culture would be complete without mentioning Bob Marley. While Marley is often seen as a global icon of reggae music, his impact on black American culture is profound. His music, filled with messages of resistance, unity and hope, resonated deeply with African Americans, especially during the civil rights movement of the 1960s and 70s. Songs like Get Up, Stand Up and Redemption Song became anthems for those fighting against oppression and injustice. Marley's Rastafarian faith, with its emphasis on African identity and spiritual liberation, also struck a chord with many African Americans exploring their own cultural roots. Moreover, Marley's influence extended beyond music. He popularized Rastafarian culture, which in turn influenced the black power movement in the US. His philosophy of one love and his calls for unity among all people of African descent continue to inspire black activists and artists alike. Jamaican actors and their contributions. In the world of entertainment, Jamaicans have also made significant contributions. Cheryl Lee Ralph, born to a Jamaican mother, has been a powerful presence in American television and film for decades. She is known for her role as Dee Mitchell in the 90s sitcom Mosher, and more recently, her Emmy-winning performance in Abbott Elementary. Ralph's work goes beyond acting. She has been a tireless advocate for the representation of Caribbean heritage in American media. Her success, along with that of other Jamaican-American actors like Harry Belafonte and Paul Campbell, has helped to bring Caribbean stories and perspectives to a broader audience, enriching the tapestry of black American culture with narratives that might otherwise have been overlooked. The political influence and rise of Kamala Harris. As we move into the realm of politics, one name stands out above all others, Kamala Harris. Her story is not only a testament to the progress made by black Americans and immigrants, but also a powerful example of the potential of the Jamaican diaspora. Kamala Harris, the first woman, first black person, and first person of South Asian descent to be elected as Vice President of the United States, proudly identifies with her Jamaican heritage through her father, Donald Harris, who immigrated to the United States from Jamaica. Donald Harris, a prominent economist and professor emeritus at Stanford University, made significant contributions to the field of economics, particularly in understanding the development of underdeveloped countries. His work provided valuable insights into the economic challenges faced by Caribbean nations, and his academic achievements paved the way for future scholars of Jamaican descent. Kamala often speaks fondly of her father's Jamaican roots, and the influence they have had on her life and values. Kamala's journey to the Vice Presidency is a story of resilience and dedication. Her achievements in public service, first as the District Attorney of San Francisco, then as the Attorney General of California, and later as a US Senator, reflect her commitment to justice and equity. Throughout her career, she has advocated for reforms in the criminal justice system fought for civil rights, and championed causes important to both the African-American and Caribbean communities. But it's not just her policy work that makes Kamala Harris a significant figure in this narrative. 
Her very presence in the highest echelons of American politics is symbolic of the strides that immigrants and their descendants have made in the United States. For many in the Jamaican diaspora, her rise to power is a source of immense pride, serving as a reminder that the contributions of Jamaicans to black American culture and society extend far beyond the arts and into the heart of governance and leadership. The broader impact of the Jamaican diaspora. Kamala Harris is just one example of the many ways in which Jamaicans have influenced black American culture and society. The broader Jamaican diaspora, consisting of millions of people, has contributed to virtually every aspect of American life. In cities like New York and Miami, where significant numbers of Jamaican immigrants reside, the cultural influence is palpable. Jamaican cuisine, for example, has become a beloved part of the American food landscape. Dishes like jerk chicken, curry goat and ackee and saltfish can be found in restaurants far beyond the borders of Jamaica. These flavours have been embraced by people of all backgrounds, making Jamaican food a staple in the culinary world. Jamaican restaurants have also become community hubs where people gather, share stories and celebrate their heritage. In the world of sports, Jamaicans have made their mark as well. Track and field stars like Usain Bolt and Shelly Ann Fraser-Price have inspired countless young athletes in the US and beyond. While they may not reside in America, their influence on black American athletes and the pride they bring to the Jamaican community is undeniable. Moreover, Jamaican entrepreneurs have also been at the forefront of business innovation in the US, contributing to industries ranging from technology to finance. The entrepreneurial spirit, deeply ingrained in Jamaican culture, has led to the creation of successful businesses that provide jobs and opportunities for many. These entrepreneurs not only contribute to the economy, but also serve as role models for the younger generation, showcasing what is possible with hard work and determination. The interconnectedness of black American and Jamaican cultures. Throughout this narrative, it becomes clear that the lines between black American and Jamaican cultures are not as distinct as they might seem. The two cultures have influenced each other in myriad ways, from music and fashion to politics and activism. This interconnectedness is a testament to the shared history and common struggles of people of African descent in the Americas. For instance, the influence of the Rastafarian movement, which originated in Jamaica, can be seen in various aspects of black American culture. The movement's emphasis on African identity and resistance to oppression resonated deeply with African Americans, particularly during the civil rights era. Figures like Bob Marley became symbols of global black unity, and his music inspired movements for justice and equality around the world. Conversely, the cultural products of black Americans, such as jazz, blues and hip-hop, have found a welcoming audience in Jamaica, where they have been adapted and reinterpreted in unique ways. This cultural exchange continues to this day, with American and Jamaican artists collaborating and influencing each other across genres. The social and political activism of Jamaicans in the US has also been shaped by this shared history. Organizations like the Caribbean American Political Action Committee, or CAPAC, and the Caribbean American Chamber of Commerce have been instrumental in advocating for the rights and interests of Caribbean immigrants and their descendants. These groups work alongside African American organizations to address issues such as racial discrimination, immigration reform and economic inequality, highlighting the common goals and solidarity between the two communities. The surprising final point, a global influence. As promised, here's the surprising final point that ties everything together. The influence of Jamaicans on black American culture is not just limited to the United States. It is truly global. From the United Kingdom to Canada and even as far as Japan, the cultural impact of the Jamaican diaspora has been felt around the world. This global reach is a testament to the strength and resilience of the Jamaican people who, despite being a small nation, have managed to leave an indelible mark on the world stage. In the UK, for example, Jamaican immigrants played a crucial role in the development of British black culture. The Windrush generation, which refers to the Caribbean immigrants who arrived in the UK between 1948 and 1971, included many Jamaicans who brought their music, food and customs with them. 
Their influence can be seen in everything from the popularity of reggae and ska to the Caribbean-inspired dishes that are now a part of British cuisine. In Canada, the story is similar. Cities like Toronto and Montreal have vibrant Jamaican communities that have significantly shaped the cultural landscape of the country. Festivals like Caribana in Toronto, which celebrates Caribbean culture, draw thousands of visitors each year and are a testament to the enduring impact of the Jamaican diaspora. Even in countries as far flung as Japan, Jamaican music and dance have found enthusiastic audiences. The reggae and dance hall scenes in Japan are thriving with local artists and DJs embracing the sounds and styles of Jamaica. This phenomenon is a powerful reminder that the contributions of Jamaicans to black culture are not confined by geography. They transcend borders and resonate with people of all backgrounds. So as we come to the end of this journey, it's clear that the contributions of Jamaicans to black American culture and society are profound and far-reaching. From music and dance to politics and social activism, Jamaicans have enriched the cultural tapestry of the United States and beyond. Their stories are a testament to the strength of the human spirit and the power of cultural exchange. If you've enjoyed this deep dive into the impact of the Jamaican diaspora, please like, comment and subscribe to join the conversation. We want to hear from you. Do you know any Jamaicans who have made a significant contribution to black American culture? Share their stories in the comments below and let's celebrate the rich and diverse legacy of Jamaican influence together. And remember, this is just the beginning. The story of Jamaican contributions to global black culture is still being written, with each new generation adding their own chapters. Stay tuned, because the best is yet to come.